In the beginning when God created the universe, the earth was formless and desolate. In his six days of creation, he made dark and light, land and sea, all sorts of life forms, and on the sixth day he made man. And thus was the creation of Adam, in God's own image and likeness. His hand always protected them. He was their defender and protector. He was their God and in him they trusted. He kept them safe from diseases and dangers. The universe was now completed and God was pleased with everything that had come to be. He loved Adam unconditionally but saw how lonely he was and said, It is not good for man to live alone. I will make a suitable companion for him. And thus, bone taken from my bone and flesh from my flesh, Eve was made. But then sin crept in like the darkness and pulled mankind away from God. They were banished out of Eden, but God still loved his creation and did not destroy it. Through the ages, sin grew stronger and pulled mankind farther away from God. God so loved the world that he sent his only son to die for us. The cross, the heavy cross on which the weight of the entire world's sins were compiled, was carried by our Lord and Saviour Jesus Christ. Oh, that precious wood of the cross. Like a precious innocent lamb drawn to slaughter, he bled out for our sins. And by his blood we are washed, we are purified and cleansed. We are healed. It is interesting to note Michelangelo's painting of Adam's creation showing the fingers never touching. God is reaching out to man with all his effort, love, power, angels and messengers. And man is simply laid back and stretching out his arm. Why? Is he comfortable in his sin or has he run out of faith in God? As for us, as new wars, Natural disasters and diseases plague us. Why are we scared? Do we not trust our Lord for protection?